The following contest is scheduled for one fall. Making his way to the ring from New Orleans, Louisiana. Weighing in at 169 pounds, Jonathan Mackey. So much has changed for this superstar since he completed his training with Booker T. A former Indy competitor, he left Houston a new athlete and set course full steam ahead for WWE. A man who elevates his game every week. He is competing at his highest level yet. Well, here comes the technical assassin of Legato Del Fantasma. If Mendoza hears sarcasm in that, he'll meet you in the parking lot. And his opponent representing Legado del Fantasma from Cordoba, Veracruz, Mexico. Weighing in at 190 pounds, Raul Mendoza. Well, here's a man who grew up idolizing Eddie Guerrero. Well, Mendoza and Legado del Fantasma continue to carry the torch of the live cheat and steal mentality. This man spent four years in NXT trying to break through before joining Legado Del Fantasma. Santos Escobar and Joaquin Wilde have taught Mendoza the discipline needed to reach new heights. This is a no disqualification match. Anything someone can dream up to do to their opponent is legal take the rules and throw them out the window. But well, this allows a superstar to pursue victory by any means necessary. And some experience a state of twisted ecstasy while punishing their adversary. We are witnessing an environment where competitors can embrace their anger and aggressive instincts because it's all legal. <laughs> I'm glad you're done believing in fairy tales, Saxton. The hero doesn't always win. Sometimes you have to embrace the darkness. Clearly waiting for that. We have company. It's the NXT champion, Finn Balor, here to scout his future opponent. Yeah, but where is he? Playing mind games, I guess. Finn's behind him. Look out. Face first into the chair. And he goes for the pin. Keeping a loss at bay for now. Oh! Right to the back.
This was as dominant a win as I've ever seen, guys. That's why they call it light work, Cole. Barely even broke a sweat.